Hey folks, Dr. Bob McCauley, and I want to do a short little video today about the world's healthiest pizza. And this is from a health expert, and a really well-known one. I kind of looked him up, and uh, anyway, he teaches us how to make the world's healthiest pizza. It's pretty amazing. Uh, talk about misinformation out on the internet. This is going to be fun. This pizza is totally legal, totally healthy, and I'm going to show you how to make it. Um, this is a great recipe. The key is the crust. Um, this, the crust is made with cauliflower and mozzarella cheese. There is no bread. There is no bad things. There's no sugar, none of that in there, no MSG. And um, this is an, a cruciferous pizza. You can um, have it as much as you want. Um, and it's actually very, very healthy for you. So let me show you exactly how to make this. And just so you know, you can have this as much as you want. So let's show you how to Well, so there you go. It really just sums it up right there. If you just take out uh, the, the flour um, and uh, the sugar, uh, apparently these are just, this is white death, you know, and then it becomes a totally healthy pizza. And you make your crust uh, out of cauliflower. Really? And this is a totally healthy pizza now? No, it's not. I mean, if that's the problem with pizza, that it's got flour and somehow sugar in it, <laughs> that's not the, those are bad things. Those aren't the only things that are really bad in a pizza. One of my favorite foods, I never eat anymore because it's not healthy. But this is his perception, and this is the perception of so many health professionals out there. You know, just the, the processed foods, the highly processed foods, the the white flour, the white sugar, you remove those and you'll be healthy. Well, that's not where health is. So we're going to go over this pizza and then I'll show you another pizza that somebody made that actually is a pretty healthy pizza. Cauliflower is a very healthy anti-aging, has a lot of phytonutrients, and then we're going to use mozzarella cheese, okay? So I'm going to do organic. Uh, you don't have to do organic. I just recommend if you can find organic, that would and be better. two eggs, whole eggs, organic eggs, or free range. Organic shredded mozzarella cheese. You can get fresh mozzarella. You could even use uh, mozzarella goat cheese. Okay, so let me just do a little uh, running commentary as he's making this. I mean, you just get some organic ingredients and it's because it's organic, suddenly it's healthy. He's got eggs, he's got cheese in there, and then he's going to cook it. He puts it out on the plate like this and, and I mean, there you go. Yeah, total, totally legal, totally healthy. You can eat this as much as you want. Uh, you won't gain weight. This is just unbelievable. And then you bake it and you get this kind of a crust. Okay. And then we're going to take tomato sauce out of a can. He, he kind of says in here, you can tell I don't cook. Yeah, right. You don't cook. So the idea that you can get this stuff out of a jar and put it in there and it's totally legal and totally healthy. It's just all he's looking for in here now, of course, is the sugar. Has it got sugar? No, it's good. It's fine. Sugar will kill you. Everything else that's cooked is just fine. You roll it out there and uh, you know you throw on some of your ingredients and this is one of my favorite parts you just come and get the the pepperoni of course you had you know his kids like pepperoni so he throws the pepperoni on it of course I, I you know pepperoni quite frankly the way it's made if you look into it it's disgusting I, you know I used to, I grew up on pepperoni but this stuff is just amazing no so I'm doing this video not because uh, I want to beat up on uh, Eric Berg he's a, a chiropractor because I don't know the guy, he's, he's got a whole line of products and everything. It's just the idea, you know, you, you, I just came across it. I was looking up how to make a raw pizza. And I came across world's healthiest pizza. And I went, this is interesting. I look at what makes this pizza so healthy? Nothing, nothing. Everything's out of a package. Just remove the flour. Make sure there's no sugar in there. And you've got the world's healthiest pizza. Just nonsense. And this is the kind of misinformation that gets out there. And so everybody's so confused and, and you think that you can just buy something organic out of a jar and just put, you know, pizza sauce. You're wasting your time uh, with that kind of nonsense, okay? I mean, just, just get fresh vegetables and cook them if you want to go that route and get away from the processed foods. So now what I want to talk to you a little bit about is this next pizza, which is a raw pizza. And if you're going to eat pizza, don't delude yourself. Um, you know, this is the way you stay healthy raw fruits and vegetables. Um, so, what you need to make the crust is zucchini, and 
you're going to need two zucchini. And I peel them and cut them up and put them in the food processor just like that. One red bell pepper cut up just like this. And, and last but not least. So let's just uh, kind of go through her pizza here, the way she's making it. Of course, what do you got? You have a bunch of vegetables, and then she put them in a dehydrator. Not a lot of people are against that and everything. So you don't want to raise the temperature up over 118 degrees. I think maybe she's got it a little bit too hot here. But the point I'm trying to make is now she's making the sauce. The sauce is just fresh fruits and vegetables. Okay, the cheese, there's actually, she's going to use the same thing, cheese. This is going to be um, cauliflower again, but uh, the kind of the funny thing about it is that there's really one well, that funny, but you can make cheese from, from nuts and it's really, really good. In fact, you can't even tell the difference sometimes if you really work on it hard enough between a, 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 a regular milk cheese or goat cheese and a nut cheese. So yeah, she puts all vegetables on it and it looks incredibly delicious. Doesn't that look delicious? Absolutely. And it is. I've had raw pizza from a, a lot of different people over the years and there's some absolutely amazing raw pizza. You go to the Creative Health Institute, there's a chef down there, Chef Pat. She makes one, a, a, she makes a pizza, raw pizza. It's just amazing. So anyway, my point here is, of course, we're back to raw fruits and vegetables and what the kind of things that you can do with them. Um, and these recipes are all over the internet and they're all over YouTube and you can find any of them on there. You know, you, there's, there's tons of them. I mean, you can really, you can make a raw pizza even with the, out dehydrating the crust for 14 hours, really within a short period of time. You can do it in a few hours if you're really determined. Um, and it's mainly just waiting for that crust to dehydrate. But this is the way where we need to be healthy and not through this first video, which is the healthiest pizza in the world just garbage uh, coming out of a can coming out of packages it's the same old stuff just remove the 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 the, f the flour and make sure there's no sugar in the sauce and and you'll be you'll be healthy and it's totally legal oh uh, and and it's it's you can eat as much as you want you won't gain weight uh, just Stick with the second video and make yourself, if you love pizza, I love pizza, make yourself a raw pizza sometime. You're going to love it. You're going to think it's fantastic. I'm Dr. Bob McCauley. See you next time, folks.